hi everybody and welcome back to my youtube channel so as you can see i have a big white face and a big brown neck so i have actually bought um the coco brown self um tan eraser i got it from sam mccauley's and it was 10 euro and i'm going to try and get some of my tan off i got a spray tan last week and i have something to go to this week as well so i need to get rid of my tan i did moisturize all week because i knew i wanted to get a fresh layer of tan on so i'm going to try it and see how it goes my friend emma hi emma um says that um it's really good it gets most of the tan off and she finds it really good so um i'm just gonna go with that but again i got it in sam mccauley's for 10 euro as you can see like my face is white my arms are brown here as well there's always a glow but my arms are brown and my hands my chest area as well and i have it on my legs but I'll show you my legs in a minute. I have no idea how to use this. So it just says to apply it three to four days after tanning. So I've done that. I got a spray tan last Friday. Today is Wednesday. Pump foam applicator and apply fresh start directly to dry skin. Okay, so don't shower beforehand. Um, leave it on for five minutes. Okay, and then shower with warm water using a wet face cloth to wipe away the tan. All right, grand. So leave it on for five minutes, then shower it off. Step four, for stubborn areas such as the knees, feet and ankles, yeah, my ankles are bad, um, use exfoliating mitt to gently remove the tan. Okay, so I have to use a mitt as well as this. Okay, um, I thought I was going to use this instead of rubbing the skin off myself. But okay, that is perfect. Marissa Carter as well, the owner of Coco Brown, is Irish. I'm always on for supporting Irish. Um, I think we should support our own. I've come from a family run business and I think it's so important to support your own. So um, again, she is Irish. I don't know her or anything like that, but I just think it's really important to support Irish brands. So if you have a phobia against feet or you hate feet, then turn away now because I'm just going to show you just my legs um, and show you the areas that I'm going to focus on getting the tan off. See here, my legs are hairy but they are like all like scaly let's see here if you can see that they're all scaly like so obviously i'm going to like scrub that off around my ankle here as well and on my foot and my toes and then my other foot is the exact same as well again i didn't moisturize here um so that's why they're all gone bad i suppose um yeah if you remember my haul and look at my ankle here if you remember my haul from what I bought in London, do you remember the shoes I bought? Oh my God, they're so sore. I, could, I have a cut here and I have a cut here as well. Oh my God, they're so painful. They're so painful. And it's the strap because I have a strap around the corner. Obviously, you can see my tan as well. It's the bloody strap. It's not even like the heel or anything. It's the strap of the bloody thing. Anyway, moving on. This is here as well where I'm wanting to focus on. But again, you can see this has gone all scaly as well. So sorry about the feet, but I just wanted to show you exactly where I was talking about. Um, so yeah, I'm going to just apply this now. I'm assuming, do I use a mitt? Don't think so, just give it a little shake. Okay, it says to use to do a patch test 24 hours to 48 hours beforehand. I'm not going to do that because I bought it yesterday and I need my tan off, so yeah. Um, do not use on broken or, skin, or sensitive skin. Okay, so if you've cuts and stuff like that, don't use it around that. Um, everything else seems okay. Oh, so it's kind of like their mousy um, tan, so it comes out white. I'm just going to rub it onto my legs. So I have the, all that pump done, one leg, half leg. I wonder do you rub it in or do you just put it on? Like I'm after rubbing it into my skin. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. So I'll rub in one leg and then I'll just apply it to this leg. But I won't rub it in. So I have that applied. I applied it to, um, I rubbed it into one of my legs and then I just applied it. Cause I'm not sure if it doesn't say whether to rub it in to your skin or to just leave it on. 
So I have rubbed it down on one leg and I've scrubbed, I've just left it on another leg. So we'll see from there. I don't know what it smells like. It doesn't smell really bad, but it doesn't smell really nice either. Kind of a bland smell. Okay, so that's just the bits and bobs that I have applied. Take off my pyjamas and just kind of go in and apply it to areas that I do not want you to see on camera. And I will let you know what I think. Okay, so I'm just out of the shower there now. Obviously, I didn't wash my hair because I want to wash it tomorrow because I want it fresh for the weekend. So, um, as you can see, like, my skin, I obviously put, like, clothes up here as well, but I'm really pale. Like, all that tan is gone. Just came down here because I wanted to be in the same lighting as I was before the video, but as you can see, like, there is, I am pale. But again, my arms are all pale as well, and I'm just going to show you my legs. See, my legs are not scaly anymore, so they are just all white <laughs> and my feet there is a little bit on my toes still here and here a bit of excess there but to be honest that could be actually me just not rubbing it to be honest do you know um i was careful with my um i was careful with my ankle like as you can remember all that was like solid brown and my little cut there and again this ankle as well most of it is gone there's a little bit here but i actually was afraid to kind of scrub here because i kept hitting my other leg where the cut was so i kind of just stayed away from that area but um again i have it here as well like the majority of the tan is gone there's a little bit there but it really could be down to just me not scrubbing that area enough my um, legs and stuff as well and um, i know there is like a little bit of patch here and there but to be honest it was probably me like it wasn't the tan um remover and again i only left the remover on i'd say it was probably on five minutes on my legs already but it wasn't on that area on here if I left a tan remover on a little bit longer, like obviously I might get a fresher, um, a, f a fresher removal. But to be honest, I think for ten euro and five minutes, like it's brilliant. Like I know that sometimes you have to leave things on, like twenty minutes to get an air of budge over. But like five minutes, ten euro, and the majority of your tan is off. Um, as well, I actually did use like a cloth just to rub it, but I wasn't scrubbing at all. And even when I started to get into the shower, I was just rubbing my, my legs like that, and it was coming away so easy. So, um, happy days. Well, how could you go wrong again? 10 euro, five minutes, and then what 10 minutes in the shower? Hi, Sophie. Hi, hi, Sophie. How did it give you? um but uh yeah so if you're in a hurry literally a 10 minute shower and um five minutes before you put on lash on a bit of tan after like it was it was really good i'm delighted with it it's definitely a thumbs up for me i will definitely use it again and i would recommend it um i have heard there is a four euro one in pennies that's supposed to be really good so uh, maybe i'll try out that soon but i'm Ha definitely happy with that and 10 euro isn't bad either it's not like 20 euro 20 euro you think about it's tenner you throw in your basket but um that is it from me thank you so much for watching if you would recommend any tan removers or anything like that please comment down below because i love trying out new things and i prefer to get something that i've been recommended than something that i'm trying myself because then if it's crap i'm raging but um thank you so so much for watching and um, i have loads more videos please check out my channel like subscribe hit that notification bell all that kind of stuff i have 35 amazing subscribers but there's always room for more thank you so so much and i'll see you in my next one bye